So, I lost everything in the tower, but not in the usual way. I ended up accidentally resetting my game. So I had to reload back. I did do a couple of runs with the Barong. Our Baron. Just a couple. Looking for items. We still haven't found any. Um, I, so I lost that roach fruit, unfortunately. And we're still looking for just stuff. I need a trained wand. Still. I ended up getting a dark sword, uh, which I think is a more rare item. It sold for 10,000. All right, uh, let's go do some town stuff real fast. Hi, welcome. Look here. You're now a top-notch hunter and popular amongst the people of this town, right, CT? Well, she made me. She made a little doll of me. I'm sure a doll that looks exactly like you would sell. This way, it would generate income for your mother, and besides, I enjoy making these. I want you to have this one, the CT mascot number one. Thanks. Darn. Yes. The mascot is attached to the purse. Come again. I'm so happy whenever I see you, CT. Uh, cool. We have a person making dolls of us now. So now we have t-shirts with our face on them. <laughs> and little dolls of us. Okay, and then we go to the theater. messed up again. You turned in the opposite direction again, didn't you? Wake up, would you? We wouldn't want the whole show to look bad just because of you, alright? You get out of our way already. Oh, CT, did you see me on stage? You did great. Thank you. I'm not that good yet. But I'm sure I'll show you much better dancing next time. Sure, look forward to it. Thanks. Okay, I just need to keep coming back and doing this. Um, I think that's pretty much everything as far as, like, things in town. I just gotta buy stuff now, right? Like, I pretty much talked out everybody except for those two. Save my data. Are Cheryl and I friends now? Not yet. Is there anything else? No, there's nothing more. That's so... I'm saving up 100000 to buy that casino. We'll probably be able to get that today because I'm going to be running in and out of the uh, tower. Only going up to like floor five-ish. I guess it depends on what we find in there. Um, Because my last run, I kept finding like pita fruits and stuff. So my barong had a bunch of uh, MP. Otherwise, it's pretty much same. Um, I'm taking a gold sword in because I'm not going to do mixture magics. I might as well get that little extra oomph. It's helped out. Oops. I don't know why I said oops. I got anything to do with that miss. Limit fruit. So yeah, the name of the game right now is to just run around and collect as much as I can until basically I get a full inventory and I'll pull up Barong. I'll trade everything to him as much as I can 
Gotta pick up these coins right now. Until we get good stuff. Like, the things that are expensive, I usually keep. Um, he typically runs out of MP before I can do all my trades anyway, so. Red Sand. As soon as we find that trained one, it's going to be, I think, with that Red Sand, plus 15. A Gold Sword. Nice. Blue sand? Blue. Nice. I think I'll use it now. Other shield plus 15. Slowly but surely. Getting that shield better. Honestly, where we're at now, we could probably get to the top of the tower, but it's just hard to say, because Kuhn right now is level 30, I want to say. And we could even take, I would probably take um, Death in, because Death is a ranged attack, and then like a Water Crystal when they run out of MP. Just use water crystal on both of them. And call it a day. Oops. That one was my fault. What a Palumpas, huh? More trolls, please. Maybe I should actually go to a room. I don't know if that's better or not. I'm not going to grind too much, basically just on this first floor here. Um, that should set me up to be... to do just fine on the... On the coming floors. The only thing I really have to worry about is like stepping on a bomb trap. And then th that could get kind of nasty. Otherwise, from here to floor six is no problem. Even seven. Seven is fine also. I think U boats do four damage to me on flat ground or two if I'm above them. Obviously, that'll change if I'm lower level. I won't have as much defense, but that's fine. In the interest of quickness. So we're just going to go around to the rooms, gather as many items as we can so we can set up our wrong. I feel lonelier. How rude. Accept your challenge. I'll give you this herb. Make her down a little. Ten wins, zero losses. Bye. You dropped me a wind crystal last time. So right now it seems like uh, probably 10% chance ish. Got a pretty small sample size, but for now. Assuming that the first one that I got was guaranteed, which I guess... I, I don't know. Level 5. 
another medicinal herb. Some white sand. Grab those. Uh, let's go back here. I could have got them in that choke point, I guess, but... This is fine. They do one damage. I was thinking, um, the flames... If that cyclone wasn't behind them with those flames, I would be able to kill them too from the ledge. Which I did. Just there was another monster behind them as well. Wow. That's it. That's the whole floor. Two rooms. Not great for my item collection. There's a sound coming from outside. Sounds like our neighbors doing construction. And probably that's the truck. They have a truck. It's kind of a cool truck that comes outside to help them. It's got like a big trailer. And inside their trailer is a mobile workshop. It's pretty sweet. I think. Too many items in the bag. Now's your time to shine. Start with this iron. Wand? Both wand. Killer, I will keep. Restore scroll, huh? A fruit, a tumna fruit. Sand, red. I guess. Um, I have another Tumna. Alchemic. The beam turns all items on the floor into gold coins. Uh, let's keep that one. Let's keep that one. That sounds pretty sweet. Another tumna fruit. Uh, well, we have a uh, second pita. Malicious bell. Iron sword. Oops. Crystal, a wind crystal. I have one, right? Yeah, I brought one with me. Monster loop. Holy sword. Holy sword with divine protection. Attack seven. Uh, yeah, we'll pick that up and keep it. I don't know how much that's going to sell for, but the Dark Sword that I got sold for 10000 So that was pretty good. Um, 
Why don't we put him back in the bag for now? Because I need to find some items to feed to him. I'm gonna keep that scorch shield, I think. Just for selling. That'll be my my backup item. Because I'm, I'm okay with using it too. Uh, we have the alchemic scroll. I'll probably use that on floor five. I'll probably gather as many items as I can into a single room. And then try to use it. Old sword. Nice. That chaos herb. Get that middle. I turn into a frog. That's it, isn't it? Oh, that's too high of a drop. I can't go back. Point of no return. Rude. Oh, no, 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 no. Come back, come back. Hey, he's gone. All right, we go up. Okay, now we do some item collection. I basically... I think I've gotten every item... Except for the one I'm looking for. Take this with me. Miss Antidote Herb. Um, let's put this on the walkway. Nice miss. All right, uh, let's bring those two items up here. This room's a little more centralized. Also, there are more items in this room. Ow. And it destroyed that item. Oh my god. Stupid bomb traps. Hate them. Here, a wind crystal, chaos trap.
Don't be nay. How's it going? How's your day going? Pretty good in yours? Doing okay. Doing okay. Um, still looking for this damn trained wand. It will not show up for me. For whatever reason. I've gotten a dark sword. I've gotten a holy sword. I just got an alchemical scroll, which I feel like has got to be pretty rare. No trained wand yet. It is really making me work for it. Egg. Otherwise, pretty good. Otherwise, pretty good. Um. Set that gently over there. Monster Hunter Rise went on sale. Again, I mean, it's kind of constantly on sale. One of my friends bought it. So we're getting getting them into Monster Hunter Rise, which we played on stream some time ago. It's on sale like every month, pretty much. Yeah. We were looking for a new game to play. We've been playing um, Dark Tide. And um, one of our friends is like, Kind of losing interest for the time being. Um, Dark Tide's about to revamp their entire leveling system, which would be cool. Um, but for now, it's getting a little stale. So I, I was like, hey, why not Monster Hunter Rise? Because it's usually like $16. <laughs> and also a good, a fun multiplayer game. A little more chill than Dark Tide. I don't know if you're familiar with Dark Tide at all, but. For 16 bucks, I don't think you can beat it. I definitely have my gripes with Monster Hunter Rise, but uh, overall, very good game. I should probably try out one of the other weapons, but mostly I'm just a great sword user. All right, uh, seven items is good enough. I guess I could I could throw out um, khaki egg. Huh. I could throw out some of these items to turn into gold. Scorch shield will be better to sell. Uh, this light fruit we can throw down. I'm a great sword enjoyer myself since the PSP games. Nice. So I haven't done a lot of Monster Hunter. I've basically just done World and Rise. Um, my first playthrough of World was Hammer. Hammer, very fun. I love spinning and winning. Second playthrough, Great Sword, really fun. Third playthrough, Long Sword. Long Sword's okay, but I really just like the Great Sword. I just like those big, chunky hits. How could you not? Hammock, use. Gold. Nice. If I didn't need all of the little herbs for giving to my Barong, that would have been a, an awesome use for them, because they usually sell for like 5 to 20. Oh, 
Rhyhorn. Got to fill up my, my Pokedex for my original 150. I don't have to, but I want to. <clears throat> so yeah, uh, Monster Hunter Rise um, for our streamed our streamed playthrough, which it's up on YouTube. If you want to check it out. Uh, we got up to Elder Dragons. I think I hunted a couple of Elder Dragons, then I was like, okay, I think we can call it here. So I didn't hunt all of the monsters, because there are a ton more monsters. <laughs> but it was fun. The Rampage thing is... interesting. I like tower defenses. It's kind of, it's a kind of interesting take on a game mode. Sometimes it's a little frustrating because when the when the main monster shows up, it just smashes through all of your all of your defenses, and that part's annoying. But other than that. Scarlet Wand. A Hell Seed. Medical Herb again. this guy. Um. Alright, let's get out uh, the Baron. Let's see. Scarlet Wand have... Come on, give me something. Sand. Blue! Use. Nice. Plus 16. Um... The rest of these can give him... MP. So let's try to find some items, I guess. I guess I'll start using the um, coins. As we find them. We got about one more floor for me to comfortably climb. But we haven't explored, fully explored this one yet either. We probably got another room. Yeah, there we are. Just another item. Another alchemic scroll. Yeah, let's put him back in the bag.
Alchemic scroll, good. Um, mostly for like little items. The problem is, is like we're gonna feed little items to Bra. So, while it's cool, it's kind of competing with what we're trying to do. This is probably gonna be our last floor. Hold on to those. A bow gun again. Man, I'm getting everything except the thing I'm looking for. Right, let's just use the scorch. A wand stream. find another item, I guess. I'm not gonna get a lot of use out of my, uh, out of my alchemic scroll, or am I? I bet the alchemic scroll doesn't sell for very much by itself. Maybe a thousand. That would make sense. It's pretty easy to get a lot more than that out of it. But I'm thinking more like very cheap. Uh, okay, what do we got here? Blue sand. We got a lot of upgrades for our leather shield this run. I think that's our fourth one. Um, this is a lovely room of items. I think I have, like, one more use out of my barong, right? Yeah, okay. Let's just do it now. Crystal. It is a water crystal! Okay, we will pick that up. We're gonna need water crystals for when we start doing real runs. But that is pretty much it for our barong. I'll try to gather up some items. Um, I could even push to the next floor. I'll have to watch out for clowns, but... Is, I don't really... I'm not gonna progress any, any further, so if it de-levels me, that's not such a big deal. Money for the casino. 
so... Nice miss. Uh, why don't we back up? Oh, he only hits me for three now. Nice. One from a ledge. Wow. Get wrecked, you boat. Yeah, so Clown would hit us for maybe four damage on flat ground. Streamlined. No item. Maybe one more room. Uh, nope. No more room. Okay, let's get these items in here. I'll use the alchemical scroll and then we'll leave. Do a nice sh short, shortish run. be five items more like six is that that stream one will throw down I think I'll look through my inventory see if there's anything else Stream wand. Throw away. These all sell for more. Um, we could throw down one of those, but I'm not going to. Yeah, let's just use it. The stream wand actually may have sold for more than 200, but that's fine. Uh, let's leave. <clears throat> I don't think Baron can give you cursed items, can he? I've never seen a cursed item come out of him. Usually they're identified, aren't they? I'm thinking about it. Gold sword plus two. Holy sword sells for 10k. Pretty good. Killer ball. Uh, we keep all of these. Troll egg. I mean, we do have a bow gun, but we'll sell. I think trolls are kind of worthless, even with their appropriate weapon. Uh, pay. Is that everything you'll be selling, right? That's about 20,000 more. Must be tired, get some sleep. I mean, pretty good run for money. Mia. What is it? So creepy. Seventy-three K we have right now. We need a hundred K for the casino. I'm off to the tower. Eat a fruit received. Open the safe. Uh, these can all go in. What do I want to? I can take a second pita. No, no, no. What I need to do is take a wind crystal. 
because otherwise I'll get stuck. Save my data, please. Anything else? No, there's nothing more. I'm gonna catch this gold duck. We're gonna go talk to people in town and back in the tower. Easy enough. Go and do your best. Yes, kiss. Eat. My heart's pounding like a stopwatch. Right, the stopwatch. I'm leaving. I hope your dream comes true. Now it's my turn, CT, to cheer you on. Okay. Welcome, Mr. CT. Time permits, please make yourself at home. All right, um, I feel like things didn't progress. Maybe I need to go to the pool. Oh no! They bullied her out of the show. Everything went so smoothly today, didn't it? It surely did. I wonder why. What do you think, Vivian? Get out of the way already. Bitch. Hold on, I want to talk to this old man. I'm in heaven, I'm in heaven. To be able to see beautiful girls in this beautiful dance. I'm in heaven, I've got to be in heaven. Lecherous old man. Oh no, she's sad. Oh, CT, you were here. You came at the right time. Look at Vivian. She's been like that for some time now. She doesn't go out, and she's hardly eating. I've never been good at coping with such a gloomy atmosphere. Hey, CT, you'd be the perfect person to cheer her up by responding to her feelings. The way you responded to my lines. CT. Why don't you dance? You're doing better without me. And I'm sure the audience would rather have it that way. Let's go for a walk. Sure, I've got nothing else to do. Let's go. Uh, let's go to the restaurant. I'd rather take a walk outside, taking all the fresh air with you. Wow, I'd forgotten how blue the sky is. Gosh, should have known. Hello, Miss Vivian. I bless this day for being able to meet you. By the way, what is your relationship with that scum beside you? Fucking asshole. I have beat you ten times in a row and have climbed to the tallest in the tower. Also, probably have the biggest house in town now. Like, also built half these buildings. Are you talking about CT? He's an important friend of mine. It mustn't be. You're being deceived. Here, come with the bar with me. Please let let me see your wonderful dancing. The bar. There's a lot of fun there to dance in that atmosphere. I had no doubts when it came to dancing. You know, I no longer go to the bar. I go to the theater. Is that so? No wonder I never see you at the bar. I imagine you'd be very beautiful dancing on that large stage. Let's go to the bar. Dance again at the theater. Theater. Me? No, I can't. I'll just get in the way of the others. I must return. I must return. Okay. I probably gotta go back to the, the theater now. I just wanna check out the bar. Nobody there. Because that's her dream. Her dream is to dance on that big stage. 
As a child, I always thought she was... A dump truck of a booty. <laughs> uh, okay, so we have to wait until next time, huh? This girl's room guys are allowed in there. Okay, sounds good. Maybe she's gonna be um the guy's partner now. We'll go talk to Cheryl. No, uh, pool. Uh, actually, let's go to here since we're here. Maybe we can ask about Cheryl. About Cheryl. She's completely recovered. Cool. Good job, bud. Yeah, I don't need to talk to you every time I come in here, Wada. All right, I promise. Selfie. Uh, okay. So not Cheryl. We'll just keep. We'll just keep going. Keep going in and out. I guess. Oh my! This is wonderful that I'm able to meet you like this, Mr. CT. Personally, I'm more relaxed in my own pool at home. I'm glad I came. I thought there might be a possibility of seeing you if I came. I'm sure this is a sign that we are to be together. Yes, I'm certain. Okay, bye. I also have a pool at home. It's on my roof. Which is the best place to keep a pool. Also, what is that symbol above that? Above the pool? It looks like a xenomorph to me. I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking at. I see like a tail. There's like a mermaid tail. And it's got like a xenomorph head. I'm sure it's fine. Do you have anything to say? Mr. CT, uh, you came to see me, right? Uh, that's right. I'm so happy. Oh, okay. Well, good talk. Save my game again real, just real fast. Did anything change? So if Cheryl says the same thing when we come back, there must be something that we have to do. Somewhere we have to meet her or something. Okay, we got our pita, we got our wind. Back into the tower. We're gonna get that training wand. I don't know if it's gonna be today, but we're gonna get it. We're committed. We got a dark sword and a holy sword. No trained wand. Didn't, 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 didn't. Although, it seems like doing these runs with the Barong are really good for making money. Um, we could probably make money faster by doing the, um... Okay. Just doing the racetrack. And betting. Because you can make a lot from that. Your odds can get up to like... <laughs> like 64 to 1 or something like that. And if you're correct and you put a thousand down, I mean, like, it's a lot of money. I'm gonna uh, use these coins for the Barong this time. As I exceed, it increases attacking power. Diamond shield! Uh, we keep.
Light seed. I need a sea seed. That's what I need. Um, I need a sea seed for my clown. My death. Poison. Uh, toxic herb, huh? Let's uh, let's just change that one. A big pita. Wow. Okay. Fair enough. Leather shield. He turned my leather shield into a leather shield. sand. Back in the bag with you. Well, do I have anything else to trade? I don't think I do. Not right now. Yeah, back, back in the bag. Increases the level, Mazar Seed. We keep, we keep that. They're light fruits. Shield Copper. And I think that's it. We can use the big pita now. Over to maximum. Ooh, MP of monster will not decrease for a while. Okay. Um. That's a good one for him. So if we got some items nearby, we feed him that, and then we can get a bunch of trades done really fast. Another Mazar. Right, back in the bag with you. Probably feed those to Kuhn, actually. Um, that will get his his healing spell leveled up. It'll only get me like one more health, but nothing. We could also give it to Death. Um, we would need to change Death's gene aspect to Wind, though, so that he can actually grow his magic. Wouldn't be that hard. I mean, bring in a wind seed, give it to him. We have one in our, or rather, we have two in our safe, so that'd be pretty easy to do. I guess it depends on who we want to be leveling up. The death is death is good because of that ranged attack. Um, but I guess we could give, we could make another one of our familiars learn 
a ranged attack. Like, we could teach them lowdown. And I guess there are a couple of more. Give me some trolls, please, and not just palumpas. Or noises. I'll take a noise as well. Really? Okay. All right, level four. All right, we, we got there. I did one run yesterday, I don't remember if it was on stream or not, but I got to like level 5 before I went up to floor 2. It's pretty sweet. Josh is just going to keep showing up in the tower, isn't he? I guess we have... Selfie is our friend already, so... She's not going to show up in here anymore, huh? Wait, no, I'll give you this herb. I guess I'll let my down to level 11 wins and 0 losses. No win, Crystal. I'll take that medicinal herb. I didn't, uh, I forgot to look to see how much damage he did to me. I was gonna see with our, our new and improved shield. I can probably kill you. Yep, I sure can. Okay, um, we're gonna hold on to that. Shield, perfect for trading. Wow. Let's just leave those here for now. Level five. Scroll, monster loop, trap loop. All right, all right. We have a lot of items to trade. Yeah, that just leads up to there. have these coins that we can do and then plus we just picked up a bunch of items oh 
I was looking, I was looking at the, uh, the troll on the map, and I was like, oh, there's a gap. There's a gap between the troll and the flame. Let's see. Wind crystal. Um, I already have one, right? Yeah. MP of monster will not decrease for a while. Yes. shield. Wand? Seal wand. Cells okay. Wand? Paralyzed wand. Tovar, eating this seed leads to good fortune. Raises luck stat? What is, what does that do? Is it permanent? Shit, another one. <laughs> nice. Truth glasses. Um, I just got a fire crystal, please. Something else. Steel sword. Magic levels returned to normal. Pick that up. Okay, that was pretty good. Um, Tovar seed. Eating this seed leads to good fortune. Huh. We got a couple of more items, but yeah, why don't we go up a floor? We'll return him to the bag. Do that all over again. If we wanted to, we can stand here and hang out and grind, but I feel like we don't need to, it's fine. Most things only do one damage to us anyway. So while it might take us a little bit to kill stuff, we're really at no risk. Hasek Herb. Come with me. Oh, this is a lovely item room. A pita fruit, too. Wow. One item back here 
is a coin. What is this? Steel sword. I got three more items down there. If he gives me an alchemical early, I might use it. Maybe. What's the shortest way? Probably back here, huh? God damn it! Stupid troll. Threw that cure-all right into his mouth. Guess that's the, the risk you take throwing things <laughs> across the room. <laughs> Let's see. Um, trap loop. Have. Baron. And then we give him the Leolum. Pick this up. Wind crystal. Try to use the least expensive stuff first.
Okay. <clears throat> Another bell. Oops. Been built to normal. Oh, shit. Didn't get quite as much out of that one. Acid rain ball. What is this? Monster? Gulf Wind Sword. Yeah, just eat it. Holy Bell. Yeah, that's fine. Staff. Money one. Okay, let's see here. <clears throat> Medicinal give. Shield. Earth shield. Shield. Wow. Okay. Um, take this holy beam, I guess. Sand, blue, use, nice. Plus 18, yeah? Yes. All right, um, this is my hell. Our last item. Potentially, I guess. Yeah, just use that. A Leola. <laughs> nice, okay, pick it up. Do it all over again. Unfortunately, I don't have a lot of things to trade right now with him. Wind crystals, I guess. I don't know what that Tovar is either. Why don't we head up a floor? Since we have that Leolum. We'll do some trades. Up there. Oops. God damn it. Well, I get one more damage. And a miss. Crit for 18. Wouldn't have been enough to one-shot. Anyway. Okay, I'm gonna save real fast. I want to look up what that Tovar is. I am curious. Balance, floors, controls... Units. Tovar seed increases evasion ratio. Hmm. I'm wondering, have you tried the Game Boy Color Azure Dreams? I have not. 
I didn't even know it existed. Um, because Azure Dreams I found... Originally, I found Azure Dreams at a garage sale. Uh, when I was a kid. Bought it for like $3. I use the item duplication exploit to create 101 Tovar seeds, feeding them all to my dragon familiar. Without leaving the dungeon, I let some trolls swing at my familiar 100 times. Dragon managed to evade a total of 8 blows, which is a normal amount. Then I had him attack 100 times against all sorts of opponents. He scored a single critical hit. So it's easy to believe that Tovar seeds, if they do anything at all, certainly do not affect crit chance or dodge chance, as so many have assumed. So it appears to me like... We'll just feed him to the Brong for more trades. It exists, is a bit different, but same in the core, really. At a Game Boy Pocket back in the day, um, never did have a Game Boy Color until I got my DS or my 3DS. <laughs> that one wasn't colored. Um, is it a pretty long game or like? Like, how's the, the dungeon crawling? Is it good? I do like dungeon crawlers. If you like dungeon crawlers, um, there is a dungeon crawler called Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. It's an old school style dungeon crawler. Uh, if you've never heard of it. Extremely brutal. Uh, but it's an old school dungeon crawler, so th they are that. Also free to play. Um, there's not a lot of, like, animations or anything. A lot of the... There is a, now, a tiles, they call it tile version, where they're actual sprites. Before, the game was a lot like Rogue. As, as in Rogue-like. The game Rogue. Where everything is just, like, ASCII symbols. Um... But it's very good. I like it a lot has a, a ton of depth to it. It's just very difficult. Never beaten Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup either. Plus, you can play it on mobile. Now, they have a mobile version. Also free to play. I also don't know why, but the Game Boy Color version, even though Inferior Console, has twice as many monsters. Interesting. Do they evolve in everything, too? No clue? Never played it that far. Sounds interesting, to say the least. What are you? Pillar Ball, again? There are a ton of items on this floor. Little item stashes. Also, egg. What was that other egg we got? I picked one up. It was a troll. It was a troll. Uh, wind crystal, get out of my life. Deep blue egg. Holy scroll.
so many items. Okay. Nice dodges. Can't dodge that. I guess this is my item room. Three more. Oh, those are all coins, too, aren't they? Why don't we start with this? I don't think we're going to be able to get through all these. This is a what? Scorch Shield Pillar Ball. Okay. Is there anything else I want to get rid of? Not really. loop, all oh, a loop, trap loop. Holy scroll. Some sort of loop. Let's check it to make sure it's not some like crazy weird loop or something. White sand. shield. Come on, give me something. Give me something I can use. Oh, I can use white sand, technically. Steel shield. Another Mazar. He just ran out. Get back in the bag with you. How am I gonna carry all this stuff? Uh, hmm. The answer is, is I can't. Energy, and then I'm gonna feed him this. Yeah, 
and you spit out a fire crystal. Okay. Um, I don't have anything else to feed him. I'm gonna save these Mazars. They're too good. Okay, back in the bag with you. Pick that up, flame ball. Throw away this to pick this up. Um, those Mazar seeds are going to be really good for our higher level monsters. I could drop the seal wand. That's only 500. These have more potential or usage. Um, I could use this is more white sand. Yeah, that is. So we could come home with three white sand, which we have a binding ball that we could use them all. On. Binding would be pretty sweet for later on in the dungeon. Throw that. And then we need to just make one more space. I don't know how much acid rain sells for with a charge in it. Um, I'm going to assume a fair bit, though. So let's get rid of the poison ball, I guess. Okay. <clears throat> this is our wind crystal, yes? Okay, so we take this with us. I'm gonna go pick up those coins, just because I'm a treasure goblin. I don't want to leave stuff around. I think Acid Rain is about 2k. Nice. We could use a white sand on those. That Acid Rain ball will probably make it sell for more. But it's fine. No treasure left behind. If I can help it. That 57 gold is going to make all the difference. Wind Crystal, use! See what we did. I mean, we got a lot of good stuff. The the white sands and the Mazar seeds. I mean, we could do a, a run just to get those uh, white sands out of our inventory. Or storage, rather. Selling some items. Hammer... Money wand, diamond, mirror. That's a nice pillar. Seven charges in it. Acid rain. Only 880 for the acid rain. That's okay. Hell ball, flame. It's still more than what that um, that seal wand was. And then we keep these. Minova. So, we already have one. Another 10k. You look cool as always. I'm here to wake you up. Cool. Good talk. 84,000. Uh, yep. Go throw some of these away in our storage. These girlfriends got to keep a closer eye on you. I'm off to the tower. Safe received. Open the safe. I have no idea how much storage we have left. We're out. <laughs> I had to I had to talk about it. All right. Um well, that means we need to make space. So binding ball. Let's take that out.
No, there's nothing more. Yeah, we're gonna have to make some space. And we have those Mazars as well, so we could uh, use those on Clown, I guess? Or Death, I mean. Put you back in here. Damn it, I had sneeze and I went away. It's stuck. <sighs> okay. Uh, money wand can go. Golf wand can go. We're never going to use it. Scarlet wand can probably go. A lot of our stuff is just water type now. Uh, wind seed could potentially go. So we're not going to use that very much. We have a bunch of Mazars. Or is this the one we put in there? Yeah, those are the ones we just put in there. We're gonna put those in. Um, sell this stuff. Is there anything else? These Leva fruits, we could also sell. We'll just sell all those. That's fine, we don't need to keep them. Decurse, I'm keeping that for that trained wand. Although if this is how we're doing trained wand, we're not gonna need that. Um, we have some more white, we have a lot more white sand, okay. So, we're gonna do some runs to clear out our inventory. Anything else I wanna put back in? Wind seed? I have a, I have an extra one in here, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I do not have an extra sea seed. So we need to get one of those. I've been looking for one for the wrong to spit out and ask Dunny yet. Okay, is there anything else? Save my data. Nothing more. Can we can we skip this? Dark Heart! What up? Love this game. Also love this game. Um it's been holding up very very good for the the memory of my childhood. I'm leaving. We need to go talk to Cheryl. We need to go talk to Vivian. Uh, sell items first, though. Let's go to fur, I guess. Right now we're looking for a certain item uh, called a trained wand. So I'm feeding it to my barong items over and over and over and waiting for him to spit one out and he hasn't done it yet started working on speed runs of this nice nice um we've had hex tree come in pretty regularly and also we had a uh, wooga stop in one day sell sell sell, sell. Which speedrun are you doing? The any percent or... 100%? Bookless? I think those are the main ones, right? Oh, look it! Oh, I little dolls of me! Three messages deleted by a moderator. Timed out. Please not use all caps, thanks. Uh, oh yeah, sorry about that. Uh, Darkheart. We've had issues with bots in the past, so I had to put a cap on the on the, on the caps thing. Um, I was making your mascot doll again. This window is my store. I'm selling pretty well. It's amazing. Until not too long ago, I've spent every day just gazing at the blue sky that reflected on the window. Right now, I'm living in the world outside of this window, and although I'm still on this side, my feelings are out there. Yes, life can be so unpredictable. If I wasn't born so weak, I might have even become a nurse. But then I might not have met you, CT. Even while I was ill, if I had not thrown that doll out the window, I might have met you. Life changes with every person you meet, and every decision you make. I hated my life so much, but now I've realized that my life is the color of the sky. 
To me, the color of the sky has always been the color I adored the most. It's the color that symbolizes the world outside the window, and also... My sky color dream is to be married to a certain somebody. But if I do marry that person, he's likely going to make me worry continuously. And I might be sick again. Even so, I'll probably be the happiest woman around. My sky color dream. Yeah, okay. Does that mean we're friends now? Quote, quote, friends. No biggie, add cap locks on and got nuked. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Doing any percent, um, and I've yet to get a full run in. Gotcha. Yeah, I mean, it, it seems like the any percent. I watched, um, I watched some of Wooga's. RNG is rough. Yeah, I watched some of Wooga's, and it seems like if you make one mistake, run is over. Like, you can get away. Sometimes you can get away with a mistake, but depending on the mistake, like that's it. And it's so easy to make later on, or everything will one-shot you. I mean, even on like floor 11, accidentally step on a bomb trap, and then like get pillared by a griffin, and that's it. Everything went smoothly today, didn't it? It surely did. I wonder why. Why do you think, Vivian? Get on my way already. Ah, bitches. OCT, you were here. Well, thank you for the follow, Darkheart. I appreciate that. You came at the right time. Look at Vivian. She's been like this for some time now. She doesn't go out and heart she's hardly eating. Well, this is the same. So I messed up last time, huh? CT. Um, why don't you dance? They're doing better without me, and I'm sure the audience would rather have it that way. Let's go for a walk. Sure, I've got nothing better to do. Let's go. Maybe I should tell her to go to the bar. Let me introduce you to my mom. I guess I'll try that one. I'd rather take a walk outside and all that fresh air. Phew. Okay, same dialogue. Oh, birds this time. Well, I'd forgotten how blue the sky is. Or maybe birds were last time, too. Yeah, then you pray for a Garuda, it seems like. I don't know Garuda was so broken until I watched Wooga. Apparently, so I was talking to Hextree about it. Um, and apparently, the there's really not a lot of difference between getting a Garuda and not getting a Garuda. Um, I think the the current speed runs right now with Garuda and without Garuda, there's like a 20 second difference or something like that. And the last run that Wooga did, that was it was almost world record. He did it a uh, Garuda less, uh, but he messed up something on the last floor, which ruined the run. But otherwise, it would have been faster than world record, and that was without Garuda. So apparently, there's not a big difference with them. It gives you a little more, gives you more tools, I guess. Oof, yeah, big oof. It's your relationship with this scum. Important friend of mine, it mustn't be. You're being deceived. Out of bar with me. It's your wonderful dancing. A lot of fun there. Um, so maybe she needs to get her her confidence back. I no longer go to the bar. I go to the theater. Is that so? Wonder if Caesar's bar. Imagine you'd be very beautiful dancing at that large stage. Let's go to the bar. To the bar? Dance at the bar? I love to dance. But will Madame allow me to dance there? She was so kind to give me a job, and then as soon as I was called on by the theater, I immediately quit the bar job. Of course she would. BRB grabbing coffee? I also need to BRB grab coffee. Because I'm out. Welcome, Mr. CT. All of you together, what's the occasion? Did you want to use the stage? Of course, it's okay. If it's enjoyable, it's fine by me. This is great. I agree. It's 
the first time we've ever agreed on anything. That's true, and not bad. I guess you're right. Yes, this is it. This is the feeling. I'm so stupid. I love dancing so much, yet I can't get myself into it. If I'm not into it, how are the customers expected to enjoy it? I froze when my dream appeared before my eyes. But I'm all right now, even on that enormous stage. Thank you, madam. What is it? She says this is a great bar. Hmm? I'm not too sure, but it appears that he's accomplished another feat. Feat accomplished. Wait, what's that? Oh yeah, the bowling alley, right, right. right. Back to the theater. Uh, nope, gotta wait until next time, apparently. But it, I think I made progression. That felt like progression. Luxury, hey, we were just talking about you, because we were talking about speedruns. How are you doing, Luxury? Cheryl. Is there anything else? There's nothing more. Doing good. That's good. Uh, yep. We're gonna go do that and then hop right out. I don't know who we're gonna give binding to. That'd be Kuhn. Give binding to Kuhn and then give uh, Fuse Kuhn with Cyclone so that he has less MP usage, since he has the most MP out of any of my familiars right now. Speaking of, I'm going to grab coffee. I'll be back in like one second. I've been grinding out these barong runs. I still haven't got a, a trained wand next year getting to the point of ridiculousness. I got a, I got a dark sword, I got a holy sword, I've got no chemical scrolls, no trained one. <laughs> is it a barong of your own? It is, yeah. I ended up um, trading a roach fruit with a barong in the tower and I snagged him and then left. We're making good money, though. Doing it. Get it received. There's a trick with uh, Minova to be able to farm Barong endlessly without running out of MP. Like a wild one? <laughs> Open the safe. Once I found that out, it was so OP. What's the trick? You need your own Manova. I have one. I haven't hatched it, but I do have one. Anything else? Uh, save my data, please. Anything else? No, there's nothing more.
When Manova transforms into another monster, whenever you bag him, his MP returns to what it was when he was still in Manova form. Interesting. So you have him transform into a Barong, trade hit with him items until he runs out of MP, bag him, and then when you pop him back out, he'll be at full MP. Is that true? Or do you need to stop right before he runs out? Farm him three times, don't let him run out of MP. Or four times, can't remember. So what happens after three times? As long as he's still conscious, then bag him, rinse, repeat. Oh, okay. Sounds good. I welcome. I surely believe I am lucky uh, because you come to see me so often. Maybe you have the time. You come see me because, well, I worry. Okay. Interesting. Uh, we'll start doing that then. To save us time. And, and if you first him with the Cyclone, it'll be more like eight times. I see. Oh, farm him three times. I, I see. So give him items three times. Uh, gotcha. Lawless execution? Looks like. Are you going to be a bitch this time? Hey, you, you weren't all that bad today. Yeah, you weren't too bad. Don't be thinking you can slack off now. CT, what did you do to Vivian? She's completely changed. And practically overnight. You're a special person, CT. Get out of my way already. That's fair. Oh, CT, you came. Did you see me on stage? You did great. Thank you. And for the other, thank you. I'll be sure to show you a much better show next time. What was the second thanks for? Sure, I look forward to it. Thanks. Any beautiful thing in the world looks pale when compared to you. In search of something that would reflect your beauty, I brought this bouquet of flowers. Thank you, gosh. Unfortunately, I must be going as I have other plans today. Flowers smell wonderful. Is that my hint to like get her a get her a gift? <laughs> Honestly, it'd be shocking to see anything about this game again. I wish they would make a remake of the uh, Game Boy Color version. Yeah. Well, unfortunately, it got like bad reviews because of all things, they said there's not a lot of replayability <laughs> for a, a roguelite. <laughs> Good job. Good job, reviewer. Whoever wrote that. Anything else? No, there's nothing. In my second place, 100% speed run, I did that for a straight one hour and five minutes before getting a roach. But at least it's way faster than repeated visits with Barong alone. Yeah. Konami is now into Pachinko. Probably forgotten all about it. That's why I avoid reviews of games. Sometimes reviews of games are helpful. But you gotta take it with a grain of salt. I I, read, I I've I remember reading a review, I can't remember what exactly what game it was. But it was some like some I think JRPG grindy one. And the review basically said there's so much grinding and there's like a whole town building mini game thing that I didn't enjoy. And I'm like, that all sounds excellent. <laughs> that sounds like a game that I want to play. <sighs> what am I doing? I came in here to not fight stuff. Mirror shield on floor one plus two, by the way. Uh, pretty good, I would say. Let's go over here. I can... It's gonna take a second. 
just went into autopilot. It's time to start exploring the dungeon. The scene has definitely changed now um, that band reviews are more popular than journalistic critic reviews. Yeah. I prefer to just see some live gameplay of it, honestly. That's how I check out games nowadays. All right, our binding ball is plus 10. Time to leave. I've had to complete a full run, honestly. I've only had about 200 short attempts. One to about 32nd floor. I'm selling some items. Mirror shield. And this monster loop. Why not? Everything will be selling? Uh, yep. Let's try to get some sleep. Morning CT, uh, you've got to get up. Okay, 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 I'll get up. Realize you've got a cutie like me. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so we have Binding Ball. We're going to give that to Kuhn, and we're going to probably fuse him with Cyclone. Clown. I have a third clown, <laughs> right, for fusing. Um, if we decide to do that. There's my Cyclone. Hatch it. Hatch the egg. Sounds good. Oh, Kuhn's gonna turn into a wind type, isn't he? When I fuse him with the Cyclone. There's our Minova egg. Um, let's just hatch this guy because we know we're gonna keep him. is. Got a couple of balloons. Is Kion currently water? He is. Yeah. So when Crystal out and continue the attempt. Okay. It's pretty tough. Yeah, so since um, wind is strong against water, he'll turn into a wind type. Right, that's how that works. I am off to the tower. It's with you, Pete, if you're received. Uh, open the safe. Put the Pete fruit away. Um, pull out. Uh, I could turn him into a fire type, I guess, which is better than wind. We got these three Mazars. I think I'm going to save those for... Clown. I got a couple more white sands, too. Um, I do have a second Binding Ball. It's only at one. Yeah, I think I'm going to go into the tower with, a, with uh, our death. Change him back to wind, feed him those bizarre seeds, and then get out. I'll have to change him back into water. Hopefully we get some sea seeds from our Barong runs. But we'll see, I guess. Um, anyway. Yeah, I guess let's scrap. Scrap this. Light. It's fine. Good enough for now. Is there anything else? Save my data. Anything else? No, there's nothing more.
Yeah, let's speed this up. Oh, I should go buy a gift, huh? Just in case that that comes up. I'm leaving. I could also buy some things for my house. Still saving up for that casino, though. We're at 87,000. Depending on what we get from the Barongs, like, we make a lot of money. I've come to buy... Oops. Wrong. I went too fast. Let's see. Handbag. A ring? Roses. The ones Gosh often gives the girls. I'll buy a handbag, too. Sure. Duck! It's Quack the Duck. Cute little thing. I'll buy it. Is there anything else I can help you with? I'm just looking. Oh, those actually go into my inventory. Shit. Alright. That's fine. Oh, she moved. She's getting more towards the front. A lot of tricks and exploits rarely actually glitches. Sand Knight is a series of beginner tutorials on YouTube to introduce some of those tricks. Gonna practice runs for a while and see where I get. I appreciate the tips. Have fun with your runs, Darkheart. I wish you luck. And good RNG. You know, you're pretty good. I'd have to agree. I mean, I had to keep up with you. Did you get out of my way already? Yeah, she's being accepted by the, by the troop. OCT, I'm so happy that you came. Did you see me on stage? You did great. I knew you were coming ahead of time, CT. I could have danced better. That's too bad. Mm -hmm. Okay. I guess I'll go give away these gifts. Who wants a duck? This is not Cheryl's house. Just looking at chat. Okay. Um, have a duck. This is for you. You're saying it's for me? Thank you. I knew she'd like the duck. Hi, welcome. Uh, CT, your character doll is selling like hotcakes. Your mother's delighted, too. This also is due to you, CT. To me, you're almost God. I'm... I'm the God. <laughs> you're exaggerating. Whenever you have the time to come see me, because, well, I worry. Okay. There's one trick I recommend starting with. It's called AI1 strats. Go a long way with just that. Oh yeah, they all went home. Um, let's give roses to Nico because she's cultural. F. This is for you. Really? Thanks. I, I'll cherish it. And then we'll give the handbag to Selfie because she cares about money. This is for you. Present for me, I will cherish it. Okay, well, it's the same thing. It's fine. Uh, okay, we talked to Cheryl. We talked to Vivian. Let's do a quick save and let's get back in that tower. And then after this run, we'll probably uh, level up death. And then I think our our storage it will be cleared out effectively and then we can start doing the barong runs with the manova this time get the best out of our time hopefully we get some um some sea seeds da -da -da. 
Okay, Kune. Collar. Give binding. Learned le bind. <laughs> le bind. Love it. Um, hmm, I wonder what type it is. Let's fuse him now. I guess. Well, no, I have no choice. Right. I thought I brought some leveling stuff with me. But I didn't know. Collar. Fuse. Lowbind is a wind type. Um. Does the level of lowbind matter? Or does it not really matter? Fuse them. MP consumption decreased and unbrainwashable. I don't have much experience with it. Interesting. Okay. Uh, maybe I want to give Kune those level up seeds then? Just to get that level up a bit? Nah, it's fine. We'll do it on death. Levels matter way more on death. Give. Back to fire type. That, um... Those spells on Q and are going to be last resort anyway. Let's just leave. Um, we can hang and try to explore the floor a little bit, but eh, that's, let's just not. We're going to get more money doing Barong runs anyway. Oh, hi, CT. Um, I'm home. Who's going to wake me up today? Cheryl has not woken me up yet. I guess she doesn't come to my house, huh? All right, death, you come with me. Add to items. Off to the tower. We have so many pita fruits. <laughs> it's a good thing, I guess. It's a good problem to have. Always useful. We might eventually want to clean some of these out, though. Um, I need a wind, two of those, and a wind, and put back Peter Fruit. So we change him to wind, we level him up so his magic gets stronger. That's the idea, anyway. Because unlike the other ones, death leveling up actually affects his magic. So, if I am not mistaken, I'm pretty sure I'm right. We've talked about this several times. I think some of the information is actually starting to stick. Oh, um, Hextry, uh, Nienna and I were talking about this the other day. For for the 100% speedrun, do you wait to befriend the girls so you can avoid this every time you leave your house? Or do you try to do it as fast as possible? Let's go talk to Cheryl, go talk to Vivian. Hi, welcome. Uh, your character doll is selling the cakes. Okay, this is... Same dialogue. 
Sounds good. That is a good optimization, yes. It can also be avoided by holding off on the final house upgrade, also by reaching floor 31. Hmm, interesting. Oh, she's front and center this time. Vivian, let's go out and have some fun. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Sorry, I've already made arrangements for today. That cute guy again, right? Excuse me, I heard that you were the owner of this place. Is that true? Yes, it's true. But strangely enough, although this guy went to the trouble of building it, he lets the staff take full control. Pretty unselfish, huh? You're kidding. I might have said some rude things to you in the past. Yes, you did. Don't worry, I told you he's given full control to the staff. That means I, the manager, choose all the performers. Regardless, even if CT was involved, CT wouldn't ignore the true ability of any person when selecting. He's not that kind of person that will fire a performer on a personal grudge. Speak for yourself, Fawn. I will absolutely do that. <laughs> He's not stupid. I'm not stupid, but I am vindictive. Excuse me, Mr. CT, would you mind letting me through, please? <laughs> You made it! I'm so glad! Oh, her picture changed now. Uh, does that mean we're friends? Special friends? I'm so glad! Did you see me on stage? You did great! I knew you were coming ahead of time. A CT, I could have danced better. That's too bad. Uh, go save to check my status girlfriend status. There it is. Seven of eight. There's nothing more. And I think the last one I get in the tower, right? Like I gotta, I have to beat the tower for the last one. good though. I didn't mess- I didn't mess any of them up. I don't know if you can permanently mess up any of those things. Okay. Death. They're hammering something, and it sounds like they're literally right behind me. Uh, give you Wind Seed. There you go. Green Death. Isn't that a video game? Green Hell. That's what it is. Give. Lowdown has increased. Give. Lowdown increased. Level 50. That's a strong spell. Technically, you can permanently mess up Nico, but it's more of a glitch where you underflow the cost of her fountain, but otherwise always possible to complete them all. How, how do you do that? <laughs> Please tell me how that happens. One person accidentally did it. That's how most glitches are found, right? <laughs> Do you, like, pay too much or something? Um, I'm home. I think you offer money that you don't have or something like that. Interesting. Oh, there's Vivian. Looks so adorable when sleeping. Good morning. It's a beautiful morning. Good morning. Hey, hey. Uh, I think I have another Mazar. We're getting big crowds every day thanks to you, CT. I'm headed for rehearsals again today. Please come to the theater to see me. If I knew you would be there to see me, CT, I believe I could dance more graciously. See you again. 
heading off the tower already. I'm off to the tower. Open the safe. Let's see. Um, I, I, well, I only have one more Mazar. Might as well take it. Let's see. Um, so we can give this PETA. What else can we do? We have a couple of um, white sands. So why don't we do... Let's see. If death is going to be our... I could give him poison. Give death poison. For a big room to poison everything and then run away. Potentially to kill it. But I feel like if I'm doing that, then I'm, nor I'm near the end of the tower. It'd probably just be better just to run away without wasting a turn to poison. So probably not a lot of use there, I guess. I don't know what else to do with this white sand. I guess I could do binding again. I can do, I can get these weak balls up if we're gonna underflow. Let's do that. If I find a, uh, a bat now, or a, a Neuel, or an Arachne, I guess. I think you offer, uh, I'm not sure whether the poison spell actually does the same things the ball does. Really? That'd be interesting. Isn't the one hit effect on poison nice? Range attack, a range attack on your melee hit. Is poison a ranged mixed magic? That would be interesting. If it's the same one from Barong. Hmm. Guess I'm not sure. But if that's true, then if a, if poison is a ranged mixed magic, that'd be pretty handy to put on somebody. Not not death because death already has a, a ranged mixed magic. That wouldn't make any sense. But putting it on like a gr my Grinute, or when I get a flame, maybe that. Or saving it for a, a bat now or a dragon. A lot of options there, I guess. I'll hold on to it. We're gonna get more white sands anyway from doing this barong stuff. I didn't take a wind crystal with me. God damn it. <laughs> it's okay, we have death. I'll be able to blast anything we come across. Level 29. I mean, I guess we could do the same thing with the weak ball, because that'll teach them lowdown, which we know for sure is arranged. Uh, death with your MP, 86, okay. Hundred and twenty six damage. That's a couple. It's a couple few. And a has exceed. Uh, ooh, is that our wind crystal? It sure is. Nice. We're not gonna waste our time in here.
I guess the nice thing about poison, if it is a ranged mixed magic, is that it's probably a water type spell. If I had to put it to one. Patty. It's another important day. Don't let a great day pass you with sleeping in. As long as you look swell. We'll head to the, the theater to see what changed, because I'm sure we'll get a unique dialogue or something. Have throw you in there. All right, we need you. Add to items. And we need you. I envied the other girls. I wanted myself to be the first girl you see when waking up, CT. To tell you the truth, I want to be here to wake you up every day. But my dad's store is so busy. I'll find time to come again, okay? Uh, so I want you to visit our store too. Bye. Heading off to the tower already? I'm off to the tower. Leave it received. Uh, pull out these. I will not be able to take a pita fruit, but that is fine. Or no, I can. Well, no, I can't, because I would rather take a wind crystal with me so I can get out when I need to, in case I don't get one last time. We need to sell that wooden wand, otherwise we're good. Anything else? Save my data. We'll go sell the wand, go see Vivian. Yeah, let's speed this up. I'm leaving. I've come to sell. Just looking around. Yeah, let's see. Go out and have some fun. Let's go, let's go. Sorry I made arrangements today. Thank you, Kai, again. Excuse me, would you mind letting me through, please? You made it, I'm so glad. Did you see me on stage? You did great. If I knew you were coming ahead of time, CT, I could have danced better. That's too bad. Hey, let's go to the pool. Good idea. Great, I'm just in the mood to go to the pool. It'd be great fun with you, CT. Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go. Oh, you brought a girl today. Uh, way to go, CT. Gotta keep a close eye on you. Enjoy your precious time with her. Wait for me by the poolside. Sorry to keep you waiting. A pool is really needed in the city of Monsbaya. Otherwise, everyone would become mummies. <laughs> Can you swim, CT? Um... Nothing's impossible for me. Let me see. Let me see you swim. Splash, splash.
Oh, that's great. To tell the truth, I can't swim. CT, you just keep swimming until you get bored. I'll be watching from here. Just getting in my daily exercise, I guess. Are you finished? Shall we go now? Let's go now. Let's go. Big jump. Flew out of that pool. Today was so much fun. You were sleeping. Even you didn't swim? Even you didn't swim? I was satisfied just watching you swim, CT. CCT, thanks for being with me today. Come again. Okay. I really expected Gosh to show up and start being a dick, and then he didn't. Uh, I think we're good. Let's just go in there. Have you become god of the tower yet? Not quite. Um, pretty soon, though. With this trick, we should... I mean, if I... If I decide, okay, no matter what of this item, I'm going to get a damn... Uh, trained wand. I could probably do it, since I have infinite. Right? We just got our inventory cleared out, so we got Clown a couple of levels. Um, we got Kune fused with the Cyclone. Did a couple of other things. Right, let's put this there. Um, this is the correct way, I think. You got the Manova? Yeah, yeah, I had one. I had one in my, my monster hut, just waiting. So we hatched him. Recovery ball, poison ball. Oh, we also uh, taught Kune uh, the binding spell out of the binding ball. I don't know if it's going to be useful for him, but definitely maybe, especially for later on in the runs. If I get cornered by some like maximums or something. Honestly, hated uh, those things until I found out how useful it was. The Manovas. Yeah, well, there's like... Seems like you can do this glitch with it, and then you can also do... Uh, you can also dupe with it. So, if you know the tricks with it, the Manova seems like real good to have. If you don't know the tricks, then sucks to suck. So. Hey, luckily I've been holding on to, like, one of each type for just in case, because every time I come across a monster, <laughs> x is like, that one's got a very interesting hidden ability or something like that. And I'm like, oh, okay, I'll, yeah, I guess I'll keep him. For now, and having no idea what it does. Um, I guess I, I haven't kept a troll. I've, I've just gotten rid of trolls. Because I remember as a kid, even getting um, some really nice troll weapons to use for them, and they, they're still kind of garbage. 
So I don't know if they have a hidden ability or something that makes them good, but I just suspect that they're kind of garbage. You probably want to take all these items to floor two, where you can farm undisturbed and no earthquake. It's a good idea. Well, I can't I can't take the coins with me, right? Or can I? Can I put them in my inventory? God damn it. You can bag the coins. Put in? What? Okay, that's that's a game changer. Accidentally walked over that one, but otherwise, nice. Okay. Uh, we got some items. I didn't know you could put them in your inventory. I assumed that they would just go into your money stash. Play this game and learn stuff every time, I swear. Yeah. <laughs> this game was way ahead of its time. There's so, so many little tricks and everything. I mean, some of them are unintended. You're going to have that, but... Try to get some XP while waiting for floor. Although with infinite MP, infinite MP, I guess wouldn't take. I guess we don't need the experience because like go up to floor two. If we don't get what we get, then we can just leave. When I ran in live tournaments once, I put a coin in my inventory knowing it would confuse the commentator, Johnny, and keep speculating as to why I did that. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> did you get interviewed after? Did he ask? <laughs> I feel like that's one of those things where you're like, okay, I have to know. Why did you do it? And he eventually figured it out. <laughs> that's funny. Level five. Nice. I always like getting level five on floor one. Good monster RNG. I wonder how much, okay, and I'm gonna pay attention to how much Gosh actually hits us for this time. <clears throat> Unless I crit him or something. It's just ET, you feel lonely when I may help. I feel lonelier. I accept your challenge. And damage. Only two! Nice. 12 wins, zero losses. Give me one crystal. Yeah. Rip gosh. Yeah, we got a, a plus 18 leather shield now. All right, so let's take out, um, let's see, collar. For as much as he brags, he very rarely makes it past the second floor. Yeah. <laughs> Command transform into Okay. 
Bag Baron. To keep his MP from dropping. I guess you could keep him out, huh? Oh, you have to keep him out. Interesting. Okay. Now I know. Command. Transform. Okay. Um. He's got 70. So let's see here. Have. Uh, red. Yeah. Okay, so it uses like 16, 15 MP every time, huh? Wind crystal. Um, I guess I will keep this. 38. That's one, two. Three. Okay. Uh, we could do one more. Safely. Looks like. Alright, down to six. And then return to the bag. You want to set both their air to one as well to keep them from moving about. Oh, yeah, good point. <clears throat> Into the bag. Line up, change AI to one. Well, I guess I should wait so that they get next to each other. Uh, that works. Line up, change AI to one. Back up to full. Wow. That's pretty amazing. Command U transform. Try not to attack my own familiar. <laughs> I would one shot it. Uh okay. Yeah, we just keep going down the line, huh? Two. Uh, hey, Hextreet, what does to what are what do Tovar seeds do? Do they do anything? I tried to find something on them, did not see anything. Three and okay, so making making sure. Dark sword? I mean, we'll keep that to self. <laughs> All right, collar. Increases luck stat, but not worth bothering with. Takes 100 seeds just to increase accuracy by like 1%. It doesn't help with the Barong item thing. I don't know what, I don't know if you know what the, uh, the calculation is for the, uh, for the, item that the Barong spits back at you. You would think so because it has it says luck in the name, but who actually like that could be anything. I don't think luck stuff affects it. Okay, sounds good. Not worth not worth doing that. It's it's just an item to um to feed to an a creature so that they get more MP. It's a shitty pita fruit. <laughs> That's what it is. Fire crystals, we don't care about. That's our second. That's three. Keep the sleep ball, I guess. Um. 
make sure. Okay, 22. That's four. Nothing. Item, Menev, return. And even worse, if you use a Tovar on Ko, his luck resets to the default with every step, next step he takes. It doesn't even last in the tower. Wow. So they're, they're a garbage seed, is what you're saying. That's number one. Blue sand? I think I'll use it now. Plus 19. Two. Three. <sighs> Life wand. Uh, double check it in this count. Ball. We'll get it sooner or later. Good call on bringing things up to floor two. Being undisturbed is a nice quality of life while I'm doing this. One, two, three, four, wand, there it is. Trained wand get, oh my goodness. GG. Um, let's just get out of here. Let's just get out of here. Congrats, thank you so much. Oh man, thank you for tips too with the Manova. Great way to get some, um, some great items too. To sit there and just trade stuff until you get things that are like a thousand and above and then leave the tower. Like, shit get money so fast. I mean, you're probably probably faster doing the racing track, I guess. Uh, Scarlet Wand, get out of my life. Gold Sword will keep as a backup, I guess. I don't know. Oh, Tovar Seed sells for a thousand. Interesting. Dark Sword 10. Sell that, sell that. Don't sell the Trained Wand. Oh my god, I would be so sad. Poison with seven charges. Uh, let's hold on to that one. We're gonna teach poison to somebody. It's a way better starting point. 14,000. I guess if you're gonna get uh, gold the fastest, I think the, um, the casino is probably the fastest way, huh? And just save scum until you 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 get the, the thing. Save, go on tower, pop out. Look cool as always. Here to wake you up. For money, racetrack and then casino is generally the fast strategy. Unless you have a picket plus a Manova dupe combo. I do. I guess I could have kept the Dark Sword for duping, huh? That's fine. Oh, we have our 100,000. That means casino time. And now time to go to the tower about 100,000 times to get this trained one to leveled up with all the red sand we have. All these girlfriends gotta keep a closer eye on you. Take this with you. Okay, that's gonna free up a ton of space in our storage, too. Is this safe for me? Throw that in there. Uh, we don't need these. Poison ball. Oh, I guess. The, oh, the other poison ball was seven. 
Okay, never mind. I thought it was lower than that. Must have been confusing it. Doing three at a time? It's gonna take a lot of trips. Anything else? No, there's nothing more. It's UCT for some reason when I see you, I can't wait to get right to work. Would you like some work? What do you want me to build? Oh, I can get a hut uh four. Expand the monster hut before it becomes full. So probably in what an eight by eight after that? Uh, 64 monsters. Casino. Where in the city do you want to build it? Right next to the racetrack. Vacant lot, vacant lot. I thought you'd be looking at about a hundred thousand gold. I'm buying. Guess I have a hundred thousand gold here. Give me a little time to build. I should have it built before you return from your adventures. I assure you, you'll be pleased with work. Nothing else to say. running out of buildings to build. I know there's a gym that I can build. I don't know what the activation for that is, though. Um, let's see. Equip. Interesting. It looks metal. This is going to increase our damage very considerably, especially on our beginning runs. We'll probably be able to just go right up to 10 without a monster. It's metal, yes. Electrocutes you on hitting Kraken and can be eaten by dragons. Excuse me? <laughs> and rusts, I think? Really? Not a rust-proof wand. No, I'm not sleepy. <laughs> it does act as a wand of the appropriate type for mixed magic though, right? For all for all types. I guess the rust at this point is not that big of a deal. Because it's, it's always going to be better than a regular wand. And if I really need to, I can just trade with my Barong Manova to get sand of those types very easily. You get the single bonus from using the mixed magic, but I don't think you get the extra bonus for the matching element. Okay. So is trained wand better then? Then if I were to use a stream wand with my... Right now, Scarlet Wand would still outperform it up to a point with the red sands. So was this even worth it to grind for? <laughs> Probably, I guess. It makes my early game better. 
and probably kind of stays same for the late game. more to go ish i think we have we're, we're gonna get it up to about plus 15. and we can check out the casino right now yeah, yeah yeah um i don't even have any money to bet in the casino <laughs> fun fact earth shield the gates crack into electricity because it's earthed interesting So Krakens are going to hurt then. But if I get enough plus on this wand, then I'll one-shot them. So I'll only have to deal with them for a little bit. I'm off the tower. So many pita fruits. I'm probably going to have to just sell all these pita fruits, huh? I don't think they're really keep they're worth keeping when I have water crystals instead. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six, seven, eight. Okay. Oh, damn, I'm almost out of wind crystals, too. Wow, those went fast, huh? Is there anything else? No, there's nothing. We're gonna have to actually go collect wind crystals. Let's go talk to old man in the temple, because he's the one who wanted the, the casino in the first place. <clears throat> ha ha ha. Let's go check it out. We don't have any money to spend, but... Yes, yes, excellent. Listen, listen, look, look, I got it. That's one million Gs. The goddess of happiness has been looking over me. Or am I the goddess? What's in here? Oh, okay, yeah, 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 right. That's, that's the game. Also this one. Slots. Welcome, oh, Mr. Owner. Yes, the casino is extremely popular amongst our customers. Uh, won't you play a little while you're here? Do I have to pay? Of course. It wouldn't be any fun otherwise, would it? Hit the switch in front of the lever by pressing the X button, and adjust the amount you wish to bet by pressing up or down on the directional button. If you've decided how much you wish to wager, press the X button. While rotating, the slot machine can be stopped by pressing the X button. If you match three of the same image, money will be paid out. Make sure you remember to collect this money. I'm so grateful for this place. At this age, I'm finally able to meet girls dressed as bunnies. They're about as cute as Eddie, a girl I dated long ago. I'm a gambler. Your name is Bet, so makes sense. Uh, narrator? I'm to the casino. Would you like an explanation of the game? Uh, yes, I'm listening. Press the X button for the switch you want to bet on. Adjust the amount you want to bet by pressing up or down on the directional button. Press the X button when betting amount has been determined. Press the X button when moving on to the diving board. If you win the bet, the roulette will spit out money. Make sure you collect this money. Good luck. Okay, let's see. 
Everything on blue. Almost. Okay, cool. I didn't want money anyway. Is there a max bet you can do at the casino? Because that was times six. Vivian is an alternate person that suggests the casino. If you build it while she's still in the bar, then she starts gambling here endlessly and you have to persuade her to stop. Oh no. That's... That's sad. Plus nine. Wind crystal me away. Wild Exadrill. I'm home. All right, pretty soon we're gonna have to start doing monster runs. Actually, because I'm just about out of crystals. I got like two more to do. Uh, open the safe. Save my game. Anything else? No, there's something more. Can't wait to get back in that tower with my fully upgraded trained wand and one shot everything. <laughs> At least on the first couple floors. Plus 12. One more to get up to plus 15. And then I think I have some odds and ends to take with me. Two. For when I get in there. Which you probably will. Um, which creature to take with? Which familiar? Death, maybe? For the ranged attack? Although he's wind type right now. So I would need to hope to find a... Seeds, uh, seed or something. I can say Kuhn too. He's got the most MP, especially now that he's fused with Cyclone. He's gonna last forever. Open the safe for me. Yeah, I'm gonna have two more. 
Blast Wind Crystal. Anything else? No, there's nothing more. This probably isn't quite as annoying if you're actually doing runs into the tower. So you don't have to see it every <laughs> every couple of minutes. Plus 15. And we leave, and now we have to do actual runs. Shouldn't be too difficult. My cat is stalking a hummingbird outside. All right, yeah, let's just grab out, uh, Q. If I'm gonna take one, I want the one with the most MP. Muff the tower. Open the safe. Need to make sure to grab my leather shield. And then, these two, if I can hold them. Yes. Anything else? Save my data. Sorry. Bot. Luckily, auto mod was on it. Anything else? Uh, nope, there's nothing more. Make sure I got everything. Plus 17 trained wand. We'll see how it behaves. Tower. It's a weird little game stuttered a bit. Plus 17. Here we go. Give me something to blow up. You. 21 damage. It's pretty good. Twenty-one damage to him too, wow. Twenty-one damage to everything? That, if it's to a troll, it's gonna one-shot. Twenty damage to the troll. 
Uh, yeah, quite a bit better, at least for un, uh, unmixed magic. I wonder how the mixed magic will be. I don't remember what Kuhn's magic is. Pretty strong. I think the last time I took him out, he did like, he's doing like 71 damage, something like that. He was very decent, I remember. Stronger than Clown. And my Grenute. Shield, Holy Scroll, Copper Coins. Nice dodge. Yeah, we're gonna definitely one-shot Gosh now. <laughs> uh, not a lot of rooms, which is fine. We'll just hang out in this main room since we're actually gonna be climbing this time. I don't know if we're going for like a, a full climb, but I at least want to have RXP in order. Definitely have the potential to one-shot flames now, too. 27 damage. It's from a ledge, but still. Olympus, where are all my trolls? Earthquake number one. Five, huh? No, level five. Rip. The CT, uh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Get lonelier. Accept your challenge. Is Gosh ever not a dick to you? One shot. Give me this herb. 13 wins, zero losses. Miss that flame. I'm sure we'll see him again. What do we got here? Red sand? Don't mind if I do. I can actually use this stuff on Git now. Instead of hoarding it. Plus 18. One shot. Yep. All right. Not a lot's going to stand a chance against us until we get up to Blooms. Even then, they'll do one damage to me. As long as I don't miss. A Wind Crystal. Nice. We already have our way out. 
love finding those early. Hmm. Not a one shot. I'm one shy. So for the cyclones, I need to stand on an on some elevation. Then I'll be able to get them. Okay, elevator room. So I'll check this. Nope. Whole lot of nothing. That's a one shot now. Yeah, give me all this XP. Perfect. More of that. let him jump up. The only thing I need to move for is a cyclone. Come on. Get me to level 7. Thank you. If I had a, uh, if I went in with my other familiar and a water crystal, this run would have a lot of potential already. They're one shot now, since I got my level. I guess I'm not sure if Manovas are going to be one shot. I don't know if I ever figured out how much health they actually have. Tomino fruits. Go up trap. That's it. Well, I guess we'll get to the elevator room just because. One shot balloons from a ledge. That's pretty nice.
to five. Seems to go on pretty fast. The, uh, hanging out on the floors doesn't seem to take too long. Trap loop. We'll save that for... Hmm, I don't know. Be a good floor for that, I guess. We might as well use it now, huh? when the XP is actually going to matter. Pork trap. <laughs> Ow. Not a one-shot from flat, but it looks like probably a one-shot from elevation. Oh, I stepped on that. Oops. I'm one damage off from killing those. Level nine. I saw you. Yeah. That should be a one shot now. Um, I guess. I got a bad roll for my damage. That one would have killed a one shot. Okay. I really got a lot left. Nice spell. Across the way. These flames seem a little spell happy today. Maybe it's because I've been just going to level one. <laughs> and to get their revenge. Not anything else to this floor, is there? Oh, it's all of it. Uh, we go to this corner room, because it's got a little ledge to stand on, but... Why don't we come down here? It seems a little more centralized. Hopefully we get more monsters in this room, rather than the one way up in the corner. That's a one-shot. Twenty-seven health. That's how much Minovas have. Nice crit. Not a one shot. Level 10, I'll, I should be able to consistently get them. Not gonna quite make it to 10 on floor 5, huh? Nope. Blooms are almost certainly gonna take two. I don't think there's a whole lot I can do about that. A wind crystal. Oops. 
Wrong button. I meant to throw it. I just set it down gently. Sword, garbage. Level 10, nice. Make sure that it saw me. shot. Nice. Probably consistently do Manovas and Balloons at this point. Especially if you crit, that helps. Okay, um... Guess I'll just stand in this room down here. Unless there's a more central one. I guess I could go up to the elevator room. Might as well. So a lot of rooms near it. Hopefully get some good spawns nearby. We got the training wand. Or trained. Trained wand. So far, it's very good. I haven't tested it with uh, Mixture Magic yet. But the damage we're doing currently, we'll be able to two-shot Clown. I bet even if... Uh, Kuhn was water type, we could probably still one-shot Clown with the, with the damage that we're doing. No level 11? No level 11. I said they moved towards the elevator. So the game could be like, no. Fall. Okay. Um. Trained wand does not rust. Trained wand does not rust. Unless that was just RNG. Shield, let's get out. And wood rust. Well, the trained wand is like metal, right? Because it, it does conduct electricity. Um, and you can upgrade it with sand. But it, you know, maybe it's made out of silver. I mean, silver. Tina's, so does gold, though. Right. 
wouldn't really call that rusting, I guess. Uh, not, no, 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 not that. Really? <laughs> Malicious Bell? Might as well use it. Give me XP. Lave Fruit. MP monster tends to decrease on that level. Okay, we don't care for that. Malicious scroll? I mean, we could throw it at something. Feeling, feeling good about it, though. So glad that we found it. As long as the meta magic is okay. Or meta magic. <laughs> Mixed your magic, not meta magic. <laughs> meta magic is a different thing. Use check for cursed items. Probably iron shield. Okay, iron shields and iron shields. So I increased the level, one damage. Twenty XP. Oh, I think the bell wore off then. I got the same amount of XP. But still, one damage from U-boats. Our shield has increased quite a bit. Plus 19. Probably in this corner, huh? Best spot. Nice dodge. I mean, if you both are consistently doing one damage to us, this floor is no different than the others. Well, that one was 19, so these ones must be the new. So the bell, okay, so the bell only affects monsters that are out on the level right at that time. It seems like. And then whatever ones spawn in, just spawn in at the regular level. I had suspected that the bell was for a limited time. So for a certain amount of time, all monsters were stronger, and then when the bell wore off, then, um... They went back to normal. <laughs> Let's just bell's permanent level up for all enemies, right. But just the ones that are out on the map, Currently. Right. Probably yes. Okay. So nobody's for sure. Level 12. Going up to floor 8 at level 12. It's pretty good. 
Also includes your own familiars if they're confused, All right? So that's how you do the... That's how you help with the underflow trick with the turning your familiar into a frog. Scarlet Wand, yes. So many little tricks to this game. You're on copper coins. Pita fruit. Don't mind if I do. Use that monster loop. That up. Sand. Blue. That is plus twenty. Plus twenty. Our leather shield's starting to become pretty serious. It's nice. We can one-shot U-boats, as long as we're on a ledge. Good to know. What's this? Paralyzed wand. Garbage. Is your goal to solo the tower without a monster? No. <laughs> that would take a long time. Well, no, no, I mean, not necessarily. I would just have to rely on speed rush threats to do that, right? But no, that's not my goal. Just trying to get as far up without pulling out a familiar to save their MP usage. Round stick two hits. Maybe from a ledge I could two shot it or one shot it, I mean. starting room. Right. I don't know why I thought he was going to move. Go back here, I guess. Yeah, that's exactly what I want. No one shot Bloom. Monster is fast though. It's really speeding up the, the floor grinds. Uh, what's the new monster on nine? Dreamin? Or is that ten? No, I think Dreamin is nine and Volcano is ten. Volcano, I'm curious about. I wonder how much damage it does to us now with our plus twenty shield. I'm gonna guess maybe five. One shot death. Or a clown, I mean. <laughs> Not death. I'd say it does two. Okay, we'll see. We'll see when we get up there. I'm gonna head up um, because I wanna save because I'm gonna take a quick break before we continue. Just in case my game resets. So I will be right back.
All right, I'm back. Um. I should change that into my text message noise. <laughs> Star glasses. Might as well use them. Leva fruit is. Want we'll to change it for next fusion? I could feed that to Kuhn, um, because he won't change from fusion anyway. So that'll just be a little extra, a little extra something something for him. Come to fruit. I wouldn't mind keeping that on me. Holy, that would be very good to keep either for regular usage or I found out that you could throw it onto an enemy monster and then they become friendly to you. Start attacking other things to protect you. I'm gonna throw... Oh, I have a leather shield. Yeah, get out. Really? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Leather shield always protecting me, even when I don't have it equipped. Okay. Let's go this way, actually. Step over the trap. Level 13. Very nice. I just leveled up, right? Oh, he tried to attack me anyway. And missed. I didn't even get to see how much damage he was going to do to me. I'm sure we'll find out. We're going to hang out on this floor and grind a little. Copper shield. Dreaming. Not quite a one shot. I'm not really afraid of being put to sleep by them, I guess. There's just not a lot of threats on the floor. They're only gonna do one. Decent next week for those things, though. Good XP for those as well. So many clowns. Oh my goodness. I mean, really, we could probably go up to 11, because I bet I can take out a griffin in two shots. The only scary thing, I guess, would be if a dreamin' put me to sleep. And then a griffin showed up and attacked me. That could be bad. Level 14. Oh, interesting. I can't see the floor where that, um, it'll look right above my level. There's a... <laughs> There's a U-boat there. I can't see the floor, but I can see him. It's funny. Alright, floor 10. 
Sleepy Troll. Crit. Or something like that happens. I guess Griffin's hit pretty, pretty hard. Okay, here he is. Let's see. Two damage. Well, Crumbing called it. Impressive. What did I win? A congratulations? There you go. <laughs> you win a sub. I'm running out of things to get rid of in my inventory. Monster loop, I guess we use... Hune is already fire type, right? Yeah. I guess I'd rather have that than the Leva in case that has something weird happen. OMG, thanks. You're welcome. Enjoy the emotes. I made them myself. There's the lowdown. Nope, that's okay. I, I had just leveled up, right? I didn't lose too much. I wanted to sub in three or four days with my prime sub, though. <laughs> well, too bad. I beat you too. Maybe next time. I mean, so far, so okay. Nothing's been too scary on these floors. Really impressed with how smooth everything's been. Even one-shot clowns. We get a good damage roll. Probably pull out Kune on the next floor, though. For just in case, if I step on a paralysis trap or a sleep trap and a griffin shows up, that could potentially be a death. Although, I'm not sure how much uh, griffins are going to hit me for either. You need, a you need so much more armor for a certain... Um, monsters as you start getting up in the tower. Like, it jumps up so much. I'm sure, like, even the Krakens are, are gonna hit me for, like, ten. Uh, yeah, you come over here. One damage from the ledge. Miss. 
Miss. There goes my XP. I'm gonna keep working on my runs, but I want to do a casual playthrough of this week. Make my ultimate Paloompa. <laughs> Oh, I think, um, so Palumpa is probably one of the worst ones, but they, they come with a pretty decent spell, right? Like, they have a heal spell or something? I freaking love that little goo puff. <laughs> Palumpa, ultimate Palumpa. You gonna underflow it? Underflow Palumpa, attack 255. Just one shot everything. Um, I should go down. I should go down, shouldn't I? Down here. This is cool. I mean, we want to play Azure Dreams again. I'm doing what I can. I just enjoy making the underdog in games as OP as possible. I like games like, um... Like, uh, Pokemon, for example. So, like, as a kid, getting your first Magikarp and being like, this is a useless Pokemon. But then if you stick with it, then you get a Gyarados. I, lo I love things like that. Um... You know, you, you put up with the kind of weak version of it, and then at a certain point, it gets very strong. Uh, there, it's like that kind of, too, in um, Final Fantasy X, specifically for Blitzball. <laughs> Blitzball. Um, if you level up Keepa, one of your starting goalie for the Besaid Orox, after you get about level 60, his stats start taking off, and by the time you're max level, he's like, he's the, I think he's the best, um, uh, Blitz player in the game. At level 99. Not as a goalie, though. I think he's like a center. My team was Savage in Pokemon X and Y, Wi-Fi battles. I never did competitive Pokemon. Um, I did do some breeding. I remember uh, in Alpha Sapphire, so some co-workers and I decided we were going to play uh, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire just to just to play it. And I ended up doing some breeding and I got my I bred my perfect growth, perfect stats, correct nature, everything it took me like two weeks of just like when I was sitting around and had really nothing to do or just watching TV, I'd just be grinding eggs the whole time. Got my perfect growth, never played it again. <laughs> I didn't even evolve it. I haven't played the new one. Um, we did play... Legends Arceus, which was cool. And we played Sword. I did not play... Was it Violet? Violet and Scarlet? All right. Iron Sword. Garbage. Blue sand, don't mind if I do. Plus 21 shield. Oh, there's our griffin. Thank you for not putting me to sleep. The construction. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Yeah. Out of Whimsicott, Deoxys Speed, Cloyster, Greninja, Kangaskhan, and Sableye. Yeah, that sounds like a very competitive team. Subseeders were so fun. 
troll status. Yeah. Alright, why don't we bring out the Kune? Let's see. Uh, let's make sure that his AI is correct. And everything else we will feed to him as we go along. These should be one shot easy with fire. 95 damage. Oh my goodness. I mean, I know they're weak to it. Still, it's quite a bit. Egg. Well, I need to make room, so... We'll give him this light seed. I might as well just give him this. Orange egg. Is that our first egg of this floor? It is. Okay. Um, hmm. What could that be that we want? I just throw this away. Keep that. A sea seed! Wow, look at that. Give. Water type. Perfect. Just in time for uh, Krakens to start showing up. It's good. Hey, how much damage do I do to you now? 73. I mean, that's still a lot. Uh, considering with the wand, stream wand, water type, I think we only did 30 to it. So, pretty big damage increase there. Be a one shot easy. 96 damage, I should hope so. Yeah, feeling fairly confident. Uh, we'll see what the Krakens do, because I know the Kraken's gonna zap me when I hit it. Hopefully, we can one shot it. We can one shot it, no problem. Okay. Uh, we ascend. One damage. Upped our level and upgraded our shield, so... <laughs> Not a whole lot they can do to us now. That was a lot less. Maybe... Oh, I was down a ledge, wasn't I? Or maybe I crit it? What are you at? You're only at 105. Right, because we fused him with a cyclone. <laughs> I forgot. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, we must have hit that first one from a ledge. Still, 62 damage from a weak element. It's pretty good. Another holy scroll. Um, I would rather have a holy scroll than a malicious scroll, I believe. Don't do that. Dealing with spammers, which luckily, um, auto mod is taken care of, so you guys don't have to see that stuff. Probably the same one. I didn't ban the first, the first message that came through. So that's my bad.
Uh, hmm. I need to not because I could attack Kyun and that would hurt. Oh, probably not Kyun too much. He's got a really high defense. Uh, here's our Kraken. We'll see. Nice, one shot. Easy. Um, it did do 10 damage to us. <laughs> Which is a lot. It's a little more than I would have expected. Okay. Don't attack the rock. Oh, I, killed, I killed your rock. What do you think about that? That's a big crit. <laughs> um, I would rather... Well, actually, Tumna will still give me experience. I guess as long as we don't run into several Krakens in a row, we'll be fine. So everything else we're pretty comfortably one-shotting. As long as I don't miss, I guess. It's always a possibility. <laughs> Paralyzed Wand. Those, uh, those are going to go so far now, since he uses so little MP, just moving around. Wooden wand. It's utter garbage. I think we are ready to ascend. We've seen all we need to on this floor. Newell's the only thing that gets big MP restores from herbs. Probably. I'm not. I'm not even sure about that. I know dragons can do metal coins. What else gets big boosts from common things? Yeah, I guess I'm not sure. This is a lot of bullshit. Hope it was worth it. Oh, shit balls. Okay. Um. Yep, I took 11. Is the zap from the Kraken percentage based? Or does it just do uh, like kind of a set amount of damage to you? Antidote herb. The more you do, the more damage you receive. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay. So what you're telling me is, is that clown would be really nice for those, so I can kill them at ranged and not get zapped. <laughs> then I won't have to worry about their conductiveness. 
I already have two ant antidote herbs, uh, so why don't we just feed this to Kuhn? It's kind of dangerous when you hit super freaking hard, yeah. I think death would be my answer to that. Or some other range spell. User. Doesn't necessarily have to be a death. The Krakens are so annoying. My first completion of this game was with Kraken, though. Yeah, somebody else said that, too. Um, somebody came in here a couple of days ago, and they're like, the first time I beat the game was with a with Kraken. They're probably pretty good brawlers, huh? Or do they mix magic? Didn't really help me out, though. <laughs> you just get, like, super lucky. Super good run. Regular iron shield. Get out of my life. What was this, a golf wand? Yeah. Ended up fusing it with an arachne. Okay. You know, that's a pretty good fusion, isn't it? That makes sense. Arachnes are definitely brawlers with their times to attack. Double attack power, yep. And then every time they get hit, they have a counter, and then plus then they hit back, and they hit hard. It's a pretty slick idea. It's It sounds like it works well. In theory, at least. Trained wand does not rust. Huh, it didn't even say about my shield. Interesting. That's weird. Maybe too much text. Text box, too big. What is that fruit? Is that a lava that I threw down? I guess I can feed it to Kuhn. That's fine. I don't want that to mess up something later. I could be wrong, but the Game Boy Color version allows you to get crazy and fuse more and more, I think. Nice. So then you could you could just have an ultimate monster with like all traits. Which sounds like fun. I don't know why this game wouldn't let you do that. I guess I would get it if this game were multiplayer somehow. To yeah, kind of keep things balanced. But with a single player game. I guess I wouldn't see why not. Heal up a little bit, and let's let's go. I have no plan about going up. I was just going up. Like I have my wind crystal, I could leave. In fact, I have my my two wind crystal because that's what we came in here to do: just collect wind crystals or grinding later. Um. I have no no thought in my head about how far this run's gonna go. So I guess we'll just keep going until we decide to leave. Whatever that means. Uh, you're gonna have a bad time right now. 56 damage. One shot with weak element. I like that. I like that quite a bit. Sand. Red sand. Nice. Oops. Plus 19. Almost plus 20. <laughs> 
Let's just take care of you now before I get sandwiched between two of them. Lave fruit. MP monster tends to decrease on that level. Grab scroll. Oops. Useless. Uh, that just goes to there. Just move on. Or not, because we're stuck. Fair enough. Okay, we've got a little bit more to look at. Oh, that was my mistake. Crystal, nice. Oh, another wind. Like that. Um, Kuhn's probably ready for another something. That could be another couple of somethings, actually. A sea seed, I need to take that with so that I can change other monsters' types. Um, death, specifically. So, I'll give you this. Pick those up. What are these? Star glasses. We can take those up to the next floor, I suppose. Anyone here got another good idea of what to accomplish in Azure Dreams besides making the best Palumpa in the world? Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm sure there's probably really fun, some really fun challenge runs that you could do. A lot of them would probably revolve around the speedrun scrats, though, I would bet. Because if you were to do something like No Familiar, that's speedrun strats. If you were to do, like, uh, Only Die in the Tower, so you could never take items back home with you, also speedrun strats. I did see on the Azure Dreams Discord that there was, um... There was some sort of challenge run posted by one of the mods in one of the... one of the categories. I don't remember exactly what that was, though. A hundred and two damage. Um, Vipers are water type, right? So I'll do neutral damage to them. Again, it'd be a nice time to have Clown. Yes, okay. Oh, I was gonna use Star Glasses. Pick this up. I'm going to have so much. I mean, just... I have a whole pita fruit <clears throat> that I can feed to Kuhn still. Do you know you can throw a holy scroll at a monster and tame it for that floor? I did know that. Um, I discovered that on one of my offline attempts where I was just trying to grind out stuff. I was like, I wonder what happens if I do this. The answer is good stuff. Um, also, I have two of them. For just in case. I also have that Olin in there for emergencies. Never thought about it like that for a while. I think it lasts until you leave. I think so as well. I think it's for the whole floor. 
or until it dies. But I mean, like, for, uh, for, a uh, beating the tower attempt. Especially on the later floors, like, could be handy. Yeah, could be super handy. Like, uh, run into a dragon or something, get cornered by a dragon or a maximum or something, and then you're just like, nope, you work for me now. And it's just like, okay. Sounds good. I was expecting a Manova to punch me in the face, but... What is this guy? Tumna. Okay. Got two of those now. We have so many fruits. I mean, we're we're really well set up to continue going. I am not well set up to go back to town. There's not a lot of things to sell in my inventory. It's crazy how they said that this game has no replay value. Value. It's nothing but replay value. Yeah. I mean, at the time that this game came out, uh, I could grab this steel shield. I think they sell decently. Not great, but decently. Let's do this medicinal. At the time, they, you know, people didn't understand rogue, what a roguelite was. A roguelike. I guess, the majority, anyway. It hadn't become popular yet, nobody knew what it would become, the genre. If they would bring this to Switch, I'd be the happiest human ever. Hell, hey, it's one of yous. I don't have a good thing to trade with you. Um, I guess some of this, some of these small guys. I could. They make up. Um, I wonder if he will... Yep. He was sleepy. Okay, he woke up now. I gotta wait for him to turn back at the frog. Another PETA. Wow. Okay, let's see here. Um, probably... I have an Oleem for emergencies, so yeah, let's use this Tumna. Give me something nice. Steel shield. Crystal? Water crystal? I'll keep that. Those are good for actual attempts, for real attempts. And I guess we will use... Antidote Herb. Give me some sand, white sand. I don't even have a ball to use it with right now. Hopefully we find a uh, one shot. Nice. Hopefully we find an acid rain ball. If we were gonna do a, uh, we're gonna keep ascending. That'd be the one that I would want, for sure. Mirror shield. Well, that's pretty good. Uh, this will top him off. 
good enough. Take that with me, it'll sell well. There's still Krakens on the on this floor? I remember. I wanna say no. I remember seeing Krakens in here with the Barongs. Could be wrong though. Use, let's see, um, steel, steel shield. Is it cursed? It's not. You can switch this up. No, okay. Sounds good. That's what I was waiting for, you. Down off of that ledge. One shot, okay. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> You sneaky, sneaky amoeba. Um, do we want another old eam? I'm gonna say no. I don't have a spell or anything. I'll just walk up and get hit by it, that's fine. Four damage from the ledge. Not so bad. Those guys were doing like 17 to me not too long ago. The defense thresholds in this game seem weird. Like, it seems like they don't do much up until a point and then they do just a whole bunch. Well, that could just be me, I guess. It seems like if it's if it's above 15, your defense means less, and like under 15, the more defense you get, it means quite a bit. It could be flat, I'm not sure. It just feels that way. Okay, check this out. That's a nothing. Check down here. That's also a nothing. There could be a small room. I think I would have seen it, though, from the other room. Level 18. I also can't believe that Kuhn is max MP. That half MP usage is just crazy. It's a big game changer. I got two Peters in reserve as well. He starts getting low. I mean, if this run goes well, we could probably make it all the way to the top without any issue. Even without speeding through. MP reduction is so good. Yeah, agreed. My first time using it because as, um, when I played this game as a kid, I never fused monsters because I didn't understand the benefits of fusing. And so I was like, why would I want to fuse my monsters away? And I'm a hoarder, so I would just keep them as I found them. I would just keep them in my, my monster hut to look at as a collection. I like filling my Pokedex. As a kid, I got my butt kicked, same. So I never beat the game as a kid, got close, but never beat it. But I think that's gonna do it for me. Um, tomorrow, when I come back, I am going to continue this run. Unless I play offline, but I suspect that I won't. Maybe I will. Maybe I will, just to grind a little bit. Um, but yeah, I think I think tomorrow, whether or not I it's this run or I, I continue a new one, I think I'm gonna go for actually getting to the top of the tower tomorrow. I think that's the plan. We got our trained wand. We got a nice shield. We got some good familiars. I think we are, I think we're good to go. We're ready to do for real attempts at this point. But we'll see. The, the top of the tower might prove to be a little much. 